<clears throat> All right, no Luke, no cat. Hmm. Do you wish to say something, High Inquisitor Darklaw? I just remembered a line from a fairy tale that I heard when I was little. A fairy tale about Bazella. The Great Witch Bazella is always accompanied by a black cat. Or so it claimed. It would seem there was a grain of truth in that fairy tale after all. That's true. Eve always follows me. Always? Oh, Nick, that means... They must have been together when the incident happened, too. Now that she mentions it... Huh. I think I saw a black cat at the bell tower when it happened. And look, the cat's on frickin' fire! What the hell? Oh yes, Eve is with me in the bell tower. Your Honor! Yes, Defender? The defense requests that Miss Cantabella's comment be added to the testimony. Very well. Request granted. Witness, add what you just said about that cat to your testimony. Yes, my lord. My cat Eve followed me as always. Hold it! So the cat Eve always follows you wherever you go? Well, not necessarily always. But when I'm especially sad or happy, like when something out of the ordinary happens, she's always there with me. I can't remember since when, but Eve has long been my dear friend. Aww. Is something in this high Inquisitor Dark Law? No, it's nothing. It just made me think of that little dog that follows Barnum around. You mean Constantine? That little puffball is so cute, too. I bet Barnum cuddles him all the time when no one's looking. When you climbed up the bell tower, your cat was with you. Is that correct? Yes, she was quietly following me. Espella looks so happy when she talks about the cat. Shit, I screwed up. I don't want to keep going. I wanted to go back. We gotta find a decisive contradiction. Alright, and how about we go through the court record again? Yeah, that's not a bad call. So the court record might have something that can help us with the contradiction. Let's read the four statements again. She realized a little bit like dormant within her. Once the evening fell and the rain ceased, I climbed up the wood stairs of that bell tower and awaited the parade. My cat Eve followed me as always. I waited for my father's speech to end, then I summoned the fire dragon. I don't know why I killed my father. Okay. That was not the court record. Hmm. Flower was stuck to rain-soaked patches. Wait a minute! Aha! Aha! We just found it! Her robe was rain-soaked. She said she didn't go up the tower till after the rain ended. That's a contradiction. You son of a bitch. Here we go. Once evening fell and rain ceased, I climbed up the wooden stairs of that bell tower and awaited the parade. Bullshit. That's it. Present the wet robe now. Present. Objection. Fuck. It didn't work. The statement clearly contradicts this piece of evidence. Oh, come on! Bullshit! That should have worked. That should have worked. Fuck you! Fuck you, Phoenix Wright, because this game always does- The first two games I played in this game do it to me. That is a logical connection. That is a contradiction. That should be correct, but the game didn't think of it, so it's wrong. Fuck Phoenix Wright. That's bullshit. I got that one right. Fuck you. Fuck you. That's 100% correct. Fuck you. So now I gotta freaking save the game. Because of bullshit. Fuck this game. Fuck you. I got that right. I hate that shit. Here. Here. I'll give you a memo. You ready? Fuck. You. Phoenix. Fuck you, you stupid game. I was correct. Hate that shit. No. Go back. Get out of here. Bullshit. 
stupid. Okay, so now I gotta try to figure out what exactly the contradiction is. Once evening fell and the rain ceased, I climbed up the wooden stairs of that bell tower and awaited the parade. So what the fuck? Touch details to see more. With that stupid hole. Alright, let's see the bell tower plan. Stairs. Crime scene. Bell free. The fuck? Vigilante's report. The bell tower was constantly guarded and there were no trespassers. Being Mozilla and using matches to kill- I don't know! What am I supposed to present here? This is incredibly stupid! Here. Hold on. I know. How do you get rid of this? I... Don't... No! What the fuck, man? What am I supposed to present here? This is bullshit! Using magic to kill the town's creator, being Bazella. Okay. Flower was stuck to rain soaked patches on the road. Mechanism of the bell tower. Doesn't help. Map of the bell tower. Doesn't help. The bell tower was constantly guarded and there were no trespassers. So maybe then I sh Okay. Maybe if I present this, they'll say, I say, well, how could you go out the bell tower if it was constantly guarded? Let's try this. Objection. This is correct. Even though my connection was correct too. Fuck you. That's bullshit. There. Bullshit. Okay. Let's continue. Bullshit. Alright. The vigilantes were guarding the bell tower all day. Is that the vigilantes report? Indeed. And according to this, the vigilantes had been constantly guarding the entrance to the bell tower ever since it appeared. Ah! However... There's nothing about a spell going up the tower in their report. Objection! Objection! Your memory must have failed you. That girl is a witch, the great witch at that. It's only natural to assume that she used something akin to invisibility magic. Isn't that so, witness? Yes, I used an invisibility spell to enter the tower unnoticed. Objection! That's right, yatch! Even magic follows certain rules of this world. We just need to be holding a Talam Magica in order to use magic. Ha! And you weren't in possession of one at the time. Oh! Objection! Objection! How horrifying your ignorance is. Excuse me? Did you honestly think the difference between a regular witch and the Great Witch is a name alone? The Great Witch, unlike other witches, can command any magic she desires without the use of a witch's scepter. Objection! Oh, that's right! Uh-uh. That's news to me! Every labyrinthian should know about that. A witch's scepter can only hold two magic gems at once. Ha! Who ever heard of a great witch that could only use two spells? Gah! Hey, did you guys ever see the movie Hocus Pocus? That's a great one. Oh, no. Order, order! In any case, this should convince you that the accused entered the tower. 